Hello everyone, welcome to this video. It's the 11th of the 11th, 2022, and it is exactly 30 days, or well, one month, since I released my Sharpie documentary, which has now been deleted by YouTube, probably at her request. Let's be honest, at her request. Has she stopped dog whistling since the release of the dog whistle video? Not a single bit. She continues to dog whistle, and let's have a look at that right now. There's three examples recently. So we've just had Halloween happen, right? So on Halloween, roughly, on October the 24th, on my website, I put this Halloween zombie woman and child video. It's a short video, it goes for one minute and three seconds. This is it right here. Zombie, women and child. That's a child there, and there's women. Women, child, and it's all zombie kind of stuff. They've got like, damage and blood on their faces, that one's got like a cross carved into the forehead there, There's that, the kid has some damage, they, they're all zombies right, they're zombies, it's a short video, I put it on my website on October 24th, the next freaking day Sharpie plays this video game, the next day she plays this game, the title image shows woman and child with face modification zombie theme, so here we go, it's the woman, it's the child, there's blood spattering on their faces. They're not zombies as such, but it looks like they've been fighting zombies, and it's a Plague Tale Requiem. It's one of the follow-on DLC of the Plague Tale. The kid there has some kind of Harry Potter birthmark type thing going on. I don't think that's just hair. I think that's like some modification to the child's genome or something. It's half zombie, perhaps. I don't know, but look at, look at this picture. The woman, the child, the blood spattering on the face, she releases, she plays this video game the next day after I've posted this on my website and I posted this on my website so looking at them together you can kind of see so I post this the next day she plays this I post this the next day she plays this women and a child woman and a child blood spattering on the faces blood spattering on the faces some kind of modification some kind of modification that's a Sharpie dog whistle right there. Okay, so that was October 24th. Let's have a look at October the 25th. So don't forget that I made a video uh, on October the 25th. Uh, I released this vid about an anonymous unknown person who commented a number of times on my channel and website. The person was anonymous. They were, they were anonymous. What were they? Anonymous. They were not revealing their identity. They played the same video game as me, they, they had said, but they didn't say who they were. The next day, Sharpie plays this video game, Player Unknown's Battleground, PUBG. The next day she plays Player Unknown's, Player Unknown's Battlegrounds. So I'm talking about, here in this video, I'm talking about an anonymous person who plays the same video game as me, they've told me they play the same video game as me, but they're refusing to say who their identity is. The next day, Sharpie plays Player Unknown's Battleground. Player Unknown, Anonymous Player. And by the way, this same person who showed up on my YouTube channel as GoPro also came back sometime later. GoPro also came back sometime later with this. So and I pinned the comment. GoPro wrote this comment on my video talking about how my documentary got deleted by YouTube. GoPro comes in, and, go, and, and in, it's so meta. In that video, I talk about GoPro. So then GoPro comes, this is Sharpie, by the way. GoPro comes back and writes in Morse code, hey, haven't seen you in Finnish lately. Come back and fly with us. And I reply to GoPro, go into the kitchen and make me a sandwich, comma, comma. <laughs> <laughs> so that's pretty hilarious and then finally so Sharpie actually releases a video this is the first and only video that she's released after my documentary the title is Spitfire VB Ace in a Flight Fear Over the Channel in caps locks fear in capitals fear fear over the channel why would she write fear over the channel why would she write fear and on the 7th of November, I was talking in the BitTrue comments with my viewers about 
uh, problems with my channel being shadow banned, concerns over my channel. Someone here comments to me, create multiple channels so you are not shadow banned, and I said it's already in the works. So here we go, 7th of November, my BitChute vid on the subject of my YouTube channel being shadow banned and under attack since I released the Shafi documentary. The next day, Shafi releases video with title Fear Over the Channel. That's true, by the way. Since I've released the Shafi documentary, I've been sh I've been I've been uh, deplatformed off of a number of places, so I've been punished. I also mentioned in uh, some of my videos away from keyboard. I mentioned away from keyboard about four times. About four times in four different videos, I mentioned away from keyboard. The acronym for away from keyboard is AFK. Uh, sometime after I'd mentioned that, Shafi, lo and behold, writes a comment at, at 13.34, blah, blah, blah. I was AFK for a moment. AFK means away from keyboard. After I mentioned the phrase away from keyboard three or four times in my daily streams leading up to the 8th of November, she references AFK. What a coincidence, right? Also, she has a salute here. In my video about her, the thumbnail has me saluting, and at the end of the video, I salute. By happenstance, her character is also saluting. Salute and salute. What a coincidence, right? The song title she uses is No Turning Back. After releasing the Shafi documentary on October 11th, I'm banned off of all IL-2 Great Battles multiplayer servers, and I'm banned off of one DCS server. For me, there is no way to undo that, i.e. no turning back. So, there you go. So she's rubbing it in. She thinks she's won. No turning back for you, she says. So yeah, just to recap, fear over the channel on the 8th of November. On the 7th of November, myself and my viewers on BitChute were discussing some concerns over my channel being shadow banned. That could be considered fear over the channel, couldn't it? Hmm? Well, maybe she just doesn't want to talk to a, to a Nazi because it's too controversial. I'm not so sure about that anymore. I think she just enjoys being uh, uh, like a cat playing with a mouse. 